We're in the Bitterroot Mountains on the uh, Clearwater River. Bald Mountain opened in 1959 with just a rope tow. It was a winter retreat for the folks that worked out of headquarters for Potlatch Corporation. The hill opened up for the public in the early 1970s. So before that, it was a membership club only. They've added a T-bar since then, but this hill is frozen in time, reminiscent of the way skiing used to be. It's just that uh, it's so friendly. You can turn your kids loose. You don't have to worry about, about anything. Uh, it's just nice uh, friendship here, and everyone likes to work together. Volunteers help keep this place running. Well, you know, a great example this morning. I got here and I shoveled, uh, I started some fires, uh, got the patrol shack cleaned up and ready for people to come in. Bald Mountain has 140 skiable acres and an 860 foot vertical drop. It's good, it's really quite a surprise. They've got some nice long groomers off the, if you go up to the top of the T-bar and go off to skier's left, there's a long groomer that you can go around down and, and take a cat track back across. And... So we've got steep and deep, we've got some tree skiing, the powder's great because it accumulates all week and then we open on Saturday, uh, and typically you can get fresh tracks all day long. And when you're done skiing, you can slide into their rustic lodge and warm up by the wood stove. Oh, it's a great place to dry your stuff when you're soaking wet and be warm, yeah. Double cheeseburger and fries. The food is good. Down home cooking. Oh, the biscuits and gravy are awesome for breakfast in the morning. And then uh, uh, it's cheeseburger in paradise. Look at how nice that looks right there. How are you doing? Awesome. The air is clean and crisp, and you don't have to wait in line here. You definitely step back in time when you come to Bald Mountain. You know, what I hear from people that come here and have, have been here in the past is, my God, it hasn't changed. You know, it's very similar to the way it was in the 50s, 60s, and 70s here. And that's why we like it. It's just a kid's playground. There's kids laying and playing everywhere in here, and they just are having a blast. It's kind of uh, the core of skiing. It's, it's wonderful to come back and visit it. Getting up to Bald Mountain is easy, especially after Walters cleared the road. So come on out to Idaho and experience Bald Mountain the way skiing used to be.